Vegetarian Mushroom Meatloaf Ingredients 2 and a half pounds assorted mushrooms, creamini. Button, portobello, oyster, chopped. 3 large leeks, cleaned, quartered, and chopped. 6 cloves garlic, minced. 2 tablespoons olive oil. 2 large eggs. 1 cup bread crumbs. 2 tablespoons heavy cream. 1 tablespoon soy sauce. Half teaspoon cayenne. 1 teaspoon garam masala. 1 teaspoon salt. 1 teaspoon pepper. Gravy. 1 and a half pounds mushrooms, sliced thin. 1 medium onion, chopped. 2 celery stalks, chopped. 2 large carrots, chopped. 6 cloves garlic, minced. 2 tablespoons olive oil. 1 tablespoon fresh thyme. 1 cup dry red wine. 6 cups slow sodium vegetable stock. 2 tablespoons butter, soft. 2 tablespoons flour. 1 fourth cup cream. Glaze. 1 third cup ketchup. 1 teaspoon soy sauce. 1 teaspoon chili sauce. 1 teaspoon vegetable oil. 1 tablespoon brown sugar. Pinch of salt and pepper. For the gravy, chop up all the veggies and add them to a medium to large saucepan along with the olive oil and cook them over medium high heat until they cook down and most of the moisture from the veggies evaporates, about 15 minutes. Add red wine and salt and pepper. Stir until red wine cooks down. Then add thyme and vegetable stock. Bring to a simmer, turn heat down to low, and simmer, uncovered until sauce reduced to 4 or 5 cups of liquid, about 30-45 minutes. For loaf, chop mushrooms, garlic, and leeks and add to a large pan with olive oil over high heat. Cook until veggies reduce down and most of the liquid evaporates, about 15 minutes. Let cool to room temperature and then mix with all the other loaf ingredients in a large bowl. You might need to add more or less breadcrumbs based on how much liquid your veggies had. Line a loaf pan with plastic wrap and scoop in your loaf mixture. Invert on a sheet pan lined with parchment paper. Remove pan and plastic wrap to leave a freestanding loaf. Bake loaf at 350 degrees for 30 minutes. Remove and brush on glaze. Return to the oven to cook for another 15-20 minutes. Note. If you use meat instead of mushrooms, you'll need to cook this for closer to 75 minutes total. Back to gravy, mix soft butter, flour, and cream together to form a smooth paste. Whisk paste into simmering sauce until smooth. Simmer until thick and silky smooth. Taste for salt and pepper. Serve gravy and sliced loaf together. Garnish with fresh thyme. Slice loaf and then pan fry the slices in a skillet with a tiny amount of vegetable oil for a few minutes per side over high heat to crisp up the sides of the slices.